one. Hey guys, Ken Jarek here. Have you ever had trouble staying motivated, doing the things that you know you want to do, you just can't seem to do it for whatever reason? When it comes time to press that go live button or that record button, you just can't seem to do it? Well, I can tell you that I've struggled with it, and I know probably most other content creators have struggled with it, or even people just in their everyday lives. So we're gonna go ahead and get into it and talk about it right now. So here's some tips that I have used for myself personally to help myself stay motivated um, because I know that it's hard, especially when you're um, a content creator or, you know, live streaming, um, making, you know, TikTok videos, whatever it is that you create. It is hard sometimes to stay motivated to actually do it because maybe you're not seeing the results that you want. You're like, oh, well, why try? Why, why am I doing this? Um, well, here's some tips that I use to help myself stay motivated. Hopefully they'll help you. Um, if you have any tips for your own, please, please, please let me know down in the comments and share them with the community because somebody else may can find that helpful as well. Well, tip number one is I like to keep a notebook with me um, or a little piece of paper, um, or if I don't have any, any of the above, I'll use my phone. I use the notes app um, or I'll use the voice recorder and I'll jot down any ideas that pop in my head and I'll say, okay, that's a good idea. I don't need to forget that because you know what they say, out of sight, out of mind. So if you forget to get that idea down somewhere, then odds are you're not going to remember it uh, in order to make content about it. Um, so it's very helpful to do that, especially if you think that it's something that's really good and it's really going to resonate um, with your community um, and with the individuals that you're trying to reach with your content. Um, I have found it helpful. I keep a notebook, like I said, in my bag, um, or I'll just use, you know, my phone and use the notes app or the voice recorder, and I'm repeating myself. So sorry about that. This is only a second video. So I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Anyways. Um, my next um, tip would be to, encouragement is very important, um, I feel like. Um, so it's important to surround yourself or to um, become part of a community that believes in what you're doing and understands what you're doing. Because sometimes when we tell like our friends and our family, um, even if you know they don't mean anything by it, they may not understand that we want to make YouTube videos or we want to live stream or we want to do this or that. I and mean, when they may not know how to encourage us or they may even discourage us with their lack of encouragement. Um, you know, they may not watch our content, they may not watch our videos, they may not, you know, join us in our live streams in the chats, um, but that doesn't mean they're trying to be ugly. It's just, you know, that's just not what they want to do so they don't understand how important it is. Um, so it's important that you build those relationships um, with individuals that do kind of the same thing that you do. Um, so that way you can all kind of support each other. Um, and you can get that encouragement, even if it's not from your family and your friends. Um, even though sometimes it's really nice when they do acknowledge what you do. Um, but, you know, if, if you aren't getting in at first, um, it's good to connect with others that give that encouragement to you. Because encouragement is very important to stay motivated. Um, because we all like to see um, results from what we're doing. Um, especially when we're putting something that we create out into the world, we want to see people take advantage of it and, and enjoy it and enjoy our content. Um, tip number three is you want to make sure that you are passionate about um, what you're doing um, and that you really cut this part out, cut this out, cut it out, cut it out, cut it out, cut it out. Okay, let's do it again. Tip number three is you want to consume as much content as you can about making content. I don't know about for you, but for me, I enjoy watching videos on how to make content, how to make YouTube videos, how to make a great thumbnail, how to do all that. Immersing myself in the industry and in the field that I want to do really, really helps to motivate me um, to make it because I want to try those tricks and say, oh, that's a good tip. I want to try it when I make a video next time. Like, like I bought um, a tripod, I have a ring light, I have a thing to hold my phone because I'm recording this on my phone gonna edit it on my phone because I saw a video done by um, oh my gosh think media it came to me I had to think about it hey oh anyways think media about how to do a complete YouTube video including all the editing the thumbnail everything on your phone and my phone is better than my camera and such on my computer so it's like well I'm gonna use that that's really good information because my first video I don't feel like it did very well. 
um, editing and, and wise, like my mouth was moved and then the sound was delayed. It was just, I don't understand what happened, but it's out there, I created it. So, but moving forward, I will take all the tips that I can um, on how to create good content and I want to apply them. So that motivates me. Um, so I suggest watching videos on something that you're not strong in, say creating a thumbnail. Watch a video on YouTube on how to create a great, great fantastic thumbnail and use those tips to create your thumbnail and that will motivate you, or at least it does me. All right, tip number four is watch content about individuals that kind of started where you're at and they blew up and they, they I don't wanna say blow up, but they got better and they created content and they kept creating content. Um, I love watching stories, success stories of other people. Um, that motivates me because I'm like, if they can do it, then I can do it as well. You know, they started somewhere similar to me. So I should, I have no excuse not to do this. Or they started off somewhere with less than what I have and they created it. So there's no reason why I shouldn't be able to do it as well. So that's tip number four is to immerse yourself and surround yourself not only in videos um tip number three like how to do things but you know other people's stories other people's journeys that's very important um in your own is that you gain from other people's experiences because there's a wealth of knowledge and a wealth of experience on the internet about people's journeys and it's very important to um or it is for me to see that to see that okay i'm not doing this wrong this is you know someone else experienced the same thing so that helps to motivate me so that's the fourth tip um, and those are just some kind of some things that I do to kind of help myself stay motivated um, the fifth and final tip is and I kind of talked about this in the first video but the fifth and final tip is to find picture where you want to be and then work backwards and say okay this is where I want to be this is my goal what am I doing today to get me there and if the answer is not what I'm doing right now, then change it. Now, obviously, sometimes we can't. Like, if your, you know, current job is taking time away from making videos, you, unless you, you know, have a source of income, you can't really just quit your job, start making YouTube videos. I mean, it'd be nice if we could, right? But we can't, um, or most people can't. Um, but do small things, like I said, you know, watch a video on how how to do something that you're not strong in. You know, how to edit a video on your phone, or how to edit your video in this piece of software. Um, learning and consuming content um, can only make you better. You can never stop learning because just when you think you know it all, they'll change something, <laughs> we'll have to learn it again. So um, you'll never know it all. So just continue to learn and continue to grow. All right, guys, so that's all that I have in this video for five tips um, on how to keep yourself motivated. I don't think I said that in the beginning that there was going to be five tips, but I decided somewhere along the way that I was going to give you five tips. So I hope those help you. Um, if they did, definitely consider subscribing, um, liking the video, um, and again, leave any comments in um, the comments on things that you do to help keep yourself motivated um, so that maybe others in the community can see them and then they might be able to apply it to their own content. Um, so that's all I got for you. Um, I do want to say that I'm going to be um, Twitch streaming again sometime. Um, in the next few weeks, hopefully once I get my schedule settled, um, but I will be back there. I will post a schedule um, on YouTube as well as on my Twitch, twitch.tv slash and I will see you guys next time. Remember creators, take care of yourself because the world needs your content. Bye.